I recently found myself in a project where I needed to draw a large circle. And I found two pieces of wood that was somewhat the same length. As you can see, one was a 45 degree angle that really didn't matter. It would have been easier if it was a straight edge. I put the screw in the top to hold them together. It would have been better if I pre-drilled the hole, that way the wood wouldn't have split as it did. This screw needs to be quite tight to hold the size of the circle when you pull it around to draw the circle. Then I drill another screw into a 45-ish angle uh, from the top of one of the legs to the bottom side of uh, the leg. And this will be the center pivot point of the compass. Again, pre-drilling might have kept it from splitting. Now in the other leg, drill a hole that is a little bit bigger than the pen you want to use. Uh, use the same 45 degree angle that you did on the center pivot screw that we did in the first leg. So this is from the outer top to the bottom side in a 45 degree ish angle. Place the pen in the hole and make sure the tip is at the same height as the screw tip on the center pivot screw. Carefully drill a screw from the inside of the leg into the pen just enough to keep it in place. Too much and you will break the pen uh, and uh, too little it won't keep the pen in place. You might need to adjust the center pivot screw so it is the same length and that it depending on how big circle you make that both the pen and the pivot screw has a good angle down into the drawing surface. In my case because I had the 45 degree angle I needed to carve away a bit of the uh, of one of the legs that was 45 degrees. And with that we're done. Now clean the surface and you can draw a really large circle.